Okay, you guys, so welcome to your workout. So um, I'm Lindsay, this is Shred. Today's workout is gonna be um, body weight here in the warm up, and then we're gonna grab some dumbbells and do some circuits, and then I've got some abs kind of built in um, everywhere. So you're gonna get cardio, you're gonna get core, you're gonna get full body, so medium sized weights. Um, so let's start with a just like a body weight warm up. So I'm gonna do a side lunge with a squat in the middle. So you're just gonna take a nice big step, side lunge, and then you're gonna come in, add that squat in the middle, and then lunge it over to that other side. So just work your way back and forth there. Take big steps. Look at this kind of like your active stretch, right? You're just going side to side. Get your squat though nice and low. And if it helps you guys, you can reach down, you can hit the floor, and then you can reach across there and you can tap like the inside of your heel on those side lunges. Okay, just take your time side to side right here. We'll spend about 20 seconds. Um, there is a little bit of jumping today, but for the most part, the workout is gonna be low impact. All right, but you can make it high, higher impact if you want. You can make it entirely low impact if you need to. You got 10 more seconds, okay? We'll go a little bit quicker. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and there's your time on that. Then the second move here I've got for us, we're going reverse lunge, we're gonna do one side at a time. So you're gonna go reverse lunge and then you're gonna pull a knee through and then you're gonna do a reverse lunge and you're gonna kick it through. So we're gonna stay on one side. So it's a reverse lunge, pull the knee, and then a reverse lunge, add that kick at the top. So let's get back here a little bit. Reverse lunge, knee, and then reverse lunge, kick. So I don't know what to do with this other hand, but I like this other arm out here. I guess you could put both arms there. That would work right there. Okay. So this is great here. We'll get a little, a little burn going on that one leg, and then we'll switch into the other side. Okay, give me like 10 more seconds, and then we'll switch. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and then we'll go right to the other side. Reverse lunge. Okay, so it takes a little bit of balance there. Okay, just find maybe a focal point, something not moving, and get those knees in, and then that kick. Get it nice and high. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Six, five, four, three, two, one. And there you go. And then this next one, there is a little bit of jumping. So we're gonna do three plank jacks and three jumping jacks, all right? So we're gonna go like three jacks here on our feet, and then you're gonna set the hands, you either kick out or step out, and you do three jacks here on the floor, okay? And then you're back up top. So three jumping jacks here, set the hands, three plank jacks, right there okay. three and three we got about 25 seconds Good. hustle on those jacks set the hands are you playing jacks 15 seconds Good. 10 9 8 7 6 5 Four, three, two, one, and there you have it. That is our first um, set of work. So we're right back up top. You guys come back up to your feet. You hit those side lunges with that squat in the middle, okay? Let's do it again, round two. Okay, let's get that body super sweaty, nice and warm. When you go down for that squat, just keep your head up, okay? Same with, with the side lunge there. My head stays above my heart. A little bit faster on the transitions here. We got 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, okay, you guys, 3, 2, and 1. And then we're going for those lunges. All right, pick a side. Here we go. Lunge, knee, lunge, kick it through. Okay, keep the core tight, right? Use your core there. Let's draw the knee, pull the leg up. 15. Good. Good. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and then we'll just switch it right to the other side. This side is a little bit less stable for me, I feel like. Whew. 
get that front thigh parallel to the floor though. When you go back on that lunge, okay, you can put your hips behind that knee. Okay, 15. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Okay, and then let's do those jumping jacks. I'm gonna adjust my camera just a little bit here. You guys go ahead and start. Okay, you got those jumping jacks. Okay, plank jacks. All right, let's go. Set the hands down. Okay. We're gonna run through this. Okay, one more time. Twenty seconds. Twelve. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and we finish. And then we're going right back up to the top. Right back to that side lunge. Here we go. Just, just a little bit there, you guys. You can see me better. Okay, here we go. Squat. Over. All right. I feel like I got lots of legs today, but I feel like I've got lots of core too. So I hope you guys love it. Give me 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, lunges, pick a leg. Here we go. Knee, kick. We have a little bit of hustle on this. A little bit of hustle. Come on. Come on. 15. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, switch. Go right to the other side, go. Right back to it. Great burden. So good. 15. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Okay, here we go. Three jacks, three plank jacks. You got 30 seconds. We'll get a drink and we'll move up. Grab some weights. Twenty. Twelve. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. And there it is. Come on up, you guys. I'm hunch up. Grab a little drink. And wow, we're gonna hit um, our first circuit with some weights. Okay, so per usual, I'm just gonna work with my eight pound, or actually they're seven pounds, but I would say for women, anywhere from seven to 12, and then guys, I would say upwards of, you know, tens to twenties. So we're gonna go deadlift into a squat, and we're gonna catch the weight. So we're gonna deadlift it here, and then we're gonna bring it up, we're gonna turn it right in front of the shoulder, catch it, and squat it. And then we're just gonna push it right back down, roll it right up, Elbows point towards the floor here. So I just wanted to start with this one here so we really wake up those hammies. You're gonna to start to wake up your arms there. All right. So my feet are right under my hips. Okay? I've kind of got like a mid stance going there. If you wanna make it a little bit wider, you could. Okay, just keep those dumbbells like right along the edge of your skin. Slide down, bring them up, elbows to the floor, and just keep repeating that. Okay, guys, we're here for another 12 seconds, and then I will have a squat with a curl. 
So we're going squats with curls. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And there it is. All right. So that squat with that curl. So we're going to go, okay, again, kind of keeping that mid stance. I'm going all the way down to the floor with my weight. But if you don't want to go down that far, you guys, if it feels like it pushes you forward too far, then just kind of stop. Okay? And then I'm just going to hammer curl right there. Okay? Squat, hammer curl. Again, my weights are just kind of squeezing right to the front of my shoulder there. Okay? Sit in your heels. Strong arms. If it feels light, then pick up something a little heavier. Okay. I have a little bit of a cardio coming at you for our third move. Okay, let's go 12, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. I'm gonna do one more. Good, okay. And then I'm gonna drop it down to just one dumbbell and I'm gonna add a raise with it. So with your weight, um, we're gonna come down into a squat and we're gonna add a little pop on this, but if you don't love the pop, then I'm gonna show you, okay? You could just squat and raise right there. If you're gonna come with me, we're gonna pop and then we're gonna raise it right there. We're just gonna come down, pop in the middle, raise it right there. Pop in the middle, raise it right there. If you don't love it, then you're just squatting and raising. No pop, okay? Good. Just raise it like shoulder level. And then go wide on your squat. And then you get 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. I'm gonna do one more and we're right back to the top. Okay? There we are, right? That was great, huh? A little cardio, a little strength in one. So let's grab our weather weight. We'll go right back to the top. All right. Whew. Give yourself that shoulder roll. Okay, we're hinging forward. Here we go. Down lift. Bring it up. Under it. And then right into your squat. Just control the weight. Push it. Roll it up. Right there. All right, right? This is a good circuit. Nice and sweaty right off the bat. 15. Good. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. And then if you want to go just a little bit wider, maybe, okay, we're hitting those squats on that curl right there. If you want to curl and twist, you can put a little twist on it too. Okay, here we go. Keep your shoulders back, chest open. Good, you guys, yep. Nice tight squeeze. Also squeeze your butt at the top there when you bring those bicep curls up, squeeze the glutes. Okay, 15, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, four, three, two, one. Okay, pop squats or regular squats with that raise. Here we go. All right, pop out, raise it. Right there. It's great to get a little back here. Too. A little core, legs, cardio. All in one move. Shoulders too. All right. Fifteen. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Okay. Let's do it. One more time. Whew. My quads. That was such a good burn. All right. Here we go. Third set. Jump in, you guys. Jump in. Let's go. Sit far back in those squats there so you don't compromise those knees. Good. Twenty. 
20 seconds. I'm gonna put a few extra here on the end. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Right to that squat with that curl. Right to that squat with that curl. Let's go. Tight curls, you guys. Tight curls. Sweet. Fifteen. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, pop squat with that raise. Here we go. All right, all right, super sweaty. All right, we'll get some water after this. Short time, 15, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, boom. Okay, wow, grab some water. That was hard. Okay, you guys, so we're moving on. We're gonna go in, let's do a little upper body, all right, because I definitely have more legs for you. Um, so we're gonna go and kind of change gears here. We're gonna do a push up with a push back, and then we're gonna pull over with a sit up. So what you need is a weight or two that you can pull over on your back. So let me grab a drink and then I'll show you. All right, so we've done something like this before, okay? So you're gonna either stick um, one weight together, or I'm sorry, stick two weights together, or you're gonna use one heavy one. Just that there. Okay, so come on with me, you guys. So we're going right here. We're gonna put the weights together. I'm using two since they're a little bit smaller. Okay, and then I'm just gonna add that single leg raise. Okay, probably just one of my favorite moves. I like to use it. We might as well add the legs if we're gonna do the pullover. But you could do the pullover without the legs too. So see what you think. Okay, let's get started. Sit tall when you come up, look up a little bit, and press. Okay, I've got a seated tricep extension for you, which is super simple, and then we'll turn over and do those push-ups. So this one's gonna give you shoulders, core, back, triceps. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and there it is. Now with that tricep extension, now you guys could totally come up and do this on your feet, okay? I'm just gonna do it here because I feel like it gives me a little extra core just by going seated, okay, with it. But if you guys wanna stand up, okay? Again, one or two weights, depending on what you got to use here, and you're just going tricep extensions. Take it to the base of your neck, and then all the way up there, okay? Just keep those elbows from coming out too far. Okay. Just bend it back and then press it high. I'm on just a slight lean, just a little bit of a lean there. Okay. 15 seconds, that's it. 15, all the way up. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Wow, right? So you could do the next move. You could do it off of your dumbbells if you wanted to, or you could do it off of the floor. Um, I'm just gonna do it off of the floor. So I'm gonna do a push up, I'll show you guys here. And then I'm just gonna pipe back. So you could do the push up on your knees and then come up to your toes, okay? Or you could go right here, you're up. So you're gonna add the push up and then you're just gonna pike up and push back, okay? And then you just reset yourself. So if you need to do it on the knees, you do a push up here. Okay, come up into a high plank and then push back. Okay, push up, push back. Okay, I'm gonna do some on my knees here. My 
triceps are already cooked. Here, come on, push back. Reset, okay? 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Wow, right? So good for those arms. Okay, let's go again. We're back to that pullover. Okay, let's go. Just want to keep minimal rest between the moves. That way we keep the body nice and warm. Let's go. Pull it over, press it up. Better. Squeeze it up. Good stuff. Fifteen seconds. Go right to those triceps. Core tight. Come on. Crunch those abs. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right. We'll put ourselves on a little bit of an incline. Here we go. Weights up. Triceps. Good. Yeah. Totally, you guys. Kneeling, standing, seated. Yes. Whatever's going to work. 15 seconds. All the way up. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Wow, right? Okay. Set those over. Okay, we're going to push up, push back. Okay, here we go. I'm going to do it on my knees for the push up. Come up into a plank and push back and then reset. Just create a little pattern if you have to go to the knees. And it feels good though to stretch back there, doesn't it? Push back. Up. 15. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and there it is. Okay, let's go. Third set. Okay. All right, here we go. All the way over with those weights. Keep those arms pretty straight. Okay. Fifteen. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. All right. Triceps. Here you go. I'm going to drop down to one. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Yep. You guys come on. Get your spots. Let's go. Fifteen. All the way out. Come on. Twelve. Ten. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Wow. Oh my gosh. Okay, push ups and then we'll be back into our feet. Come on. Okay, a little 30 seconds. I'm trying to do this last set on my toes. I challenge you if you can, hop up and do it. 15. Ten. 
10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And there it is. Wow. That was so good. Right? Arms, core. All right. Come on back up, you guys. Let's get a quick sip of water and then we're moving on. Okay. So this next circuit, um, we're going to do a, let's see here. What do I have? So it's a curtsy with a press. Okay. So we're going to curtsy, lunge, press. Now, if you need to do a single press, you can always do one arm at a time. Okay. I'm going to maybe start with both arms, but my shoulders are feeling like really fatigued. So, um, one or two presses, and then we are going to do, um, an, uh, up down to where we go to, to our knees. So if you need to modify the up down, then you would just do a squat. Okay. So follow me here. We're going curtsy with the press. I was going to have you guys press at the top. So you're going to curtsy back. Okay. And then just press out of that at the top there. All right. You guys, I want to make sure you can see me here. So you got curtsy with the press. I still have to adjust my camera a little bit here. My lack of space. All right, here we go. Curtsy press. And you can do two, or you can do one arm at a time, okay? Curtsy, press, okay? Curtsy, press. I cannot find the right angle here. <laughs> Whew. Curtsy back, press out, there we go. Curtsy back, press out. Try to keep those weights right under your shoulders there. That'll give you a little bit of work. Okay, come on. Short time, short time, 15, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, finish up a couple more if you need to, and then I'm going to show you guys the next move. Um, we're going to do an up down with a press, so just one weight for this, okay? And I'm gonna just hold it right here off my chest and I'm gonna go down, down, press, up, up, press, down, down, press, up, up. And you can see I'm not fully standing up. I'm just kinda of keeping my legs loaded there, okay? Pushing that weight off right there, okay? Right off the chest, drawing it back in. So you can go heavier if you want, do one at the bottom, and one at the top. Now, if you want to just squat and press, look, squat, press there, and then stand up and press there. Squat, press at the bottom, stand up and press at the top. Okay, so you can leave the floor workout if you need to, if it's too hard in the knees, okay? I'm just kind of trying to stay low here. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, and one. Wow, right? Lots of legs there. And then I'm just gonna do bears. All right, so we're gonna go, okay, we're in our bear position right here, and I'm just doing that heel raise, okay? I'm working off of my weights here, okay? And I'm just kicking that heel up, and then bringing that knee right back under my hip. Okay, core tight. So we're gonna get quads, we're gonna get glutes, we're going to get a little bit of hamstrings, cardio, kind of built in, core, shoulders, right? Come on, 15. Heel like you're going to push that heel through the ceiling. Come on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Okay. So then we're right back up to that curtsy with that press, okay? Curtsy with that press, you guys ready? Single or double press, three, two, one. Let's go curtsy, press it out. Curtsy, press it out, go. Try to get that front thigh parallel, big steps behind. Big steps behind, come on, come on. Press. Good. Short time, 15, 12. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Okay, one weight. Okay. Squatting, we're going down with me. Here we go. We're just going to stay low. 
okay? When you step in, you want to step, okay, kind of a little wide, like right here. Not too close. Go down, down, push, up, up, push. Good. Down, down, push, up, up, push. Come on, burn these legs up. Come on. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Okay, hit that bear with me. Hands right into your shoulders, knees right into your hips. Okay, heel to the ceiling, on or off of your dumbbells, on or off of your weights. Eyes between your hands. Keeping those knees hip distance apart as well. Okay. 15. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. 3. 2. And 1. Okay. You guys, we got this. Okay. One more time. Let's go. I have two more sections of work. Okay. We have a little more leg and upper body kind of combo. And then I got the core, okay? We're close. Let's go. We'll try to be done here in about 12 minutes. Come on, press. Critzy. I'm pressing at the bottom. I'm gonna come up and press at the top. There we go. I was just gonna get it harder for myself. <laughs> yeah. Okay, down, out, down, out. 15. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, okay, one of your weights, here we go, press right at the bottom, press at the top, go, stay low, good squats, if you're squatting, push, good, down, 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 push, go. 15, all the way out, you guys, all the way out, go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and time, okay? Rows. All right, you ready? Bears, go. Pull your core in too, pull your core in. Be aware. 20. 15. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And there you have it. So good, right? Grab yourself a drink, you guys, grab yourself a drink. Okay, we gotta hustle because we're already at 40 something minutes, all right? So I'm gonna be quick on this one here. We're doing a single row, okay? And then we're gonna fully stand up. Now you're gonna pass your weight. If you wanna do um, kind of a heavier weight, that would be great if you've got the option for this. Or you can use a kettlebell. And then I'm doing plank row turn press. And then I'm doing chest with some flutters. Actually, you know what? We're gonna kind of tie this in with some core, okay? So I'll have four moves and then we'll plank at the end, you guys, okay? So just work with me here. First one here, all you need is one dumbbell, okay? So you're gonna basically, right here, you're gonna row it, okay? And then you're gonna fully stand up and pass it. I'm gonna row, okay? Fully stand up, pass it right there. Side to side, so it's like a bent row, single side. You come up, squeeze your butt, just like you do on a deadlift. Add that row on the other arm. Stand up. See where a kettlebell could totally work for this single row right there. Pass it off right there. Hinge, row, fully stand up, pass while you squeeze your butt there at the top. Drive that elbow up and back. Go. I don't like this one right here. Okay, low back, legs and butt. Okay, go. Go. 
I'll give you 15 more seconds. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. I'm going to do one more. 3, 2, 1, go. Okay, so now you guys, with this plank row, okay, we're just going to kind of like row and turn it. So right here, you're off of your weights if you can. Okay, we've done these before. You're going to turn it and press it up. And then when you bring it back into the middle here, you're going to give me four mountain climbers. One, two, three, four. And then you're going to do that other side. Turn and press. One, two, three, four in the middle. Turn and press. Okay, jump in. One, two, three, four in the middle. You can always just do rows if you need to on the knees. And leave that turn press out. You can do plank rows. Hustle on those mountain climbers. Hustle. Come on. 20 seconds. I'm going to do a little more time. Come on. 15, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two, and one. And then we're going chest with flutter kicks. Okay. Nothing fancy, regular chest presses. Okay. So then you're just going to add those flutter kicks with it. Now if it's too much, then just do chest presses with no flutter kicks. All right. It doesn't have to be super heavy on your weight because you've got those legs up. Okay. Just go, go reps on reps. Okay. You got 20 seconds. This one's fast. Okay. Here we go. Squeeze them up right across your chest line. Go. A few extra seconds. 15. Look up, you guys. Look up. Relax. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Okay, weights to the side. Here, you're going to give me those bicycles. Bicycles, let's go. Kick those heels all the way up. Heels all the way up. Come across. Touch that elbow to the knee. Let's go. Come on. Write it out. Write it out. 20. You can slow it down a little bit. 12. 11. 10. 9. 8. 7. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, we're back to the top. So all you need is that one dumbbell, okay? For that row, go a little heavy, okay? Up to your feet. I'm gonna start, you guys, join me, okay? So here we go. We hinge, row, stand up, pass. Hinge, row, stand up, pass it off. Right there. Two row, right? You're gonna go elbow right along your rib, up and back, stand, pass, right there. Squeeze. Awesome, awesome, you guys. 15, come on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, three, two, and one. Okay, down. You've got that plank row turn, four mountain climbers. Okay, let's go. And then that chest press is next. We'll flip right over. Okay, we are in the home stretch, you guys. Home stretch. Come on. Twenty. Move those weights. Be quick on those knees. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, chest quickly. Get there. Again, if you want to go heavier on the chest, go heavier. Leave the flutters out. I'm down. Okay, make this yours, you guys. Here we go. Come on. 
quick, quick. Squeeze, squeeze. Wide elbows, okay. High press, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Okay, weights to the side, bicycles. Let's go slow. Let's go slow. Heels out, elbows come across. Go. Twenty. Twelve. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Up. Okay, let's do it. Last set. Okay. We ready. I'm excited. I love this move. Okay, it feels good. Kind of finish up here. Row it and then stand up and pass. Come on. Be big. Be big. You gotta create that squeeze on those glutes. Come on. Squeeze tight. Squeeze. 20. Yes. 15. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. You ready to go? Okay, let's go. Plank row, turn press. Mountain climbers, come on. Hustle. Run them in. 14. Come on. 13. 12. 11. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. 3. 2. Over. Chest with flutters. Here we go, gang. 5. Get there. 4. 3. 2. 1. Come on. Go. Go. Reps on reps. Reps on reps. Press, press, shoulders up if you can. 15. Yes, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Weights to the side, bicycles. We're gonna finish with a plank, you guys. Okay, we got like right above a minute. Okay, good bikes, good bikes, go, go. Ride. I'm gonna let you ride fast on this last set as long as they're good. Okay, 20 seconds, go. 15, 12, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay. Quickly flip over, give me 10 plank twist, and then we're gonna hold for the rest of the minute, okay? 10 plank twist, here we go, three, two, one. Twist it across, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold, hold, okay, lock in. And you give me another little challenge here. If you want it, give me 10 shoulder taps, okay? If you want, give me 10 taps. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Now let's go 30 seconds. Hold. 
Long and strong, guys, long and strong. 20. Okay, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and there it is. Oh man, that was a big one. I appreciate you guys working hard. That was like 53 minutes. So um, great job. Super sweaty, full body, little different moves. You guys take care. Have a great day.